And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Ladies, Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight we will be on the observation deck. Still don't have your own? You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no, bring it into focus on your own. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very selfsame stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Hello again. Brilliant class, wasn't it? I prefer astronomy over portions, don't you? Of course, we Ravenclaws tend to do well in any class. <laughs> oh, hello, Amit. Nice to see you again. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. Well, I. I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh. reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Has put off my stargazing as long as this was his old telescope. <laughs> Looks practically brand new. <sighs> A pristine night. Professor Shah. It is increasing. But if you true we ourselves. Am I right in thinking you are unimpressed? Of the many other so-called disciplines taught here, divination is perhaps the most feeble. Do not confuse astronomy and astrology. One is concerned with mysteries stellar and lunar. The other... You mentioned astronomy tables. Long ago. For centuries, wizards made... Sadly, they... Thank you, Professor. I am glad to hear. The perfect night for... Oh. I have the telescope. It's nice. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> yes, what? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens, and it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could... And you need someone to help? I do. Are you in? Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get... 
No need to convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. You won't regret it. Shall we? The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something Rebellion. that doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. Levius. Lumos. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Lumos. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. It's not that creepy out here at night, is it? The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. Hmm. Revelio. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as tidy as I expected. Amit, could I ask you something? Oh, um, certainly. Where precisely? According to an old astronomer's chronicle, I... Why are you so fascinated? I suppose because there is so much to learn about. I mean, there is plenty to learn about. They are forever discovering new moons and stuff. Actually, that's all I want. Oh, very well then. Revelio. More cobwebs. You don't think any spiders might be lurking about? Oh no, not this close to school, I mean. Revelio. Look, there's the table. I think you should do the honors. Go on. The constellation should appear near the center of your view. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far star. And your contribution was invaluable. Thank you, Amit. I look forward. And I look forward to writing. This is only the beginning. You will. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. That's quite generous. You are welcome. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook. Ahem. Anyway, glad. Never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. friend. Psst, over here, quietly. I am glad that you received my owl. We need to stay low and remain quiet. Nazi, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hulk's head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. And after you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down, for good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. I'll help you find the letter. I'm glad to hear it. 
First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check. I do not see any guards, but we should still try. Rebellion. Hmm. I wonder what that does. Depulsor. That did it. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. Accio, Wingardium Leviosa. Gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. Revelio. Must be another way in. Accio! That looks as if it might raise the gate. I knew you could do Revelio. This way. I will get the door. <laughs> that is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Hallow and the letter inside. We'll need to be careful once we get... I hear them. Yeah. Restrain the beast! Hi, Wing. Do you know that hippogriff? Get these things back now. Very well. New plan. I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Blast it! There's got to be another way to get up to the roof. Somewhere. Revelio. 
I hope Natty stays out of trouble. Revelio. Not the safest place to sneak into. Revelio. Traficus Totalus. I hope Natty's having an easier time of it. Aloha, Mora. Mora. Rebellion. Deke was right. We need to save you from these barbarians.
Revelio. 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 Wing. It's all right. There we go. Oh, there you are. Come on. A lot more. Hurry. There's the Hogwarts Express. Must be returning from an unscheduled run. It's incredible, isn't it? How exciting. <laughs> it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we were going to make it out alive. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rookwood's looking for a phoenix. <laughs> Not sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees it. Now, tell me, where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Hyrum before. Poppy introduced us. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you.
How about some sightseeing? I have learned of a wizard who is being harassed by Halo. He may be able to provide the evidence we need to take Halo down. We should speak with him together. Meet me at his home. When you have a moment, please stop by the Room of Requirement. Deke tells me he has something to share with you. I assume you have news regarding the goblin you mentioned. Why don't we meet at the map chamber to discuss that and our next steps? Deke would like to talk with you when you have a moment. Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you wanted to tell me more about the loom. Ah, hello. Uh, yes, about that. Uh, Deke has had a thought. He... <gasps> Seems the room thinks you need more space for your beasts. A as Deke was saying, uh, he's had a thought. Now, Deke knows how you can test the item of clothes and uh, perhaps... What do you mean? Tub's master doesn't let him leave the cave. And Deke knows the cave is infested with spies. That sounds awful. It is. Deke has... As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test... I understand. Leave. Oh, thank you. Revelio. Yeah. <laughs> 
Rebellion. Pressed ominous regarding Salazar Slytherin's scriptorium. My efforts were in vain. Meet me outside the Slytherin common room. We need to talk. Rebellion.
Revelio. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. Professor Howen will never believe this. I'll look after you. Not going to hurt you. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Washing your plow is good on the <laughs> Just let me know if there's something in particular you're looking for. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help.
What are you up to now? Rebellion. Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. <laughs> 